we take a look at some of the most incredible transforming robots. At number 7, a real transformer. The talented Ishida may have not built a real life size war machine, but this mini transformer is still really impressive. It has quite a few server motors, 22 to be exact, and it can fend for itself with some fighting abilities. The robot is made from quite a few 3D printed parts, and it's one of the few RC vehicles which you can actually move. The creator's ultimate goal is to build a real life transformer within the next decade, and hopefully it doesn't have AI in it. At number 6, the QROS-1. This robot's a little bit older, but it's one of the first machines which can transform from a woolen sphere to a walking mechanism. Japan's Chiba Institute of Technology developed and built the robot, and it's quite impressive considering it can walk over rough terrain with four agile legs. Once things get a little bit smoother, it can start rolling over six times faster and take down some targets once weaponized. It's a really cool robot, nothing really advanced or anything like that, but it does lead us into number five, the Morphex Mark III, which is really epic. This is one of my favorites, and yet another talented builder has built a very incredible rolling machine. Now it's on its third version, so the robot can transform between a rolling sphere to a walking hexapod. Once again, there's a very detailed layout of the build on the creator's website, and an overview of some of the challenges associated with the build. The coding is also pretty innovative, and it's a testament to Mr. Halverson's skill level. I do think Boston Dynamics should hire this guy and continue on with this project and it just shows you some of the best robots are actually homemade. At number 4, Mr. Hansen's self-transforming robot. I had to dig through quite a few videos to actually find this one, and this robot's a little bit older, but it's still one of the most innovative projects ever built. It can actually manipulate its chassis in order to walk, crouch, and do other crazy acrobatic maneuvers. It can climb ramps, pass through tiny gaps, and even climb over obstacles. But more importantly, it can transverse on its built-in wheels. So we are probably looking at the next evolution of off-world rover technology. At number 3, the Bionic Wheel Bot. Now Festo has brought forth many several animal robots, including a butterfly, a kangaroo, and even a bat. But this new creation is kind of like a Star Wars battle droid. Don't worry, it's not weaponized just yet. So the inspiration was driven by real-life spiders, which can rover through the wind. Um, maybe a little bit of Star Wars innovation too. It utilizes spring legs to punch the robot along, and it's kind of like the Morphex. So it would be cool to see another version of this machine. And who knows, maybe the droid army thing will actually become a real thing and enslave the entire human race. At number 2, Origami Bots. So you're probably like, ah JD, you covered this thing before. And MIT has been working on this really unique project for some time now. But it has evolved, and these mini-bots are now controlled by external magnetic fields, and they have an incredible ability to form pre-programmed shapes. Just keep in mind that they're not fully automated just yet. So basically a primer absorbs the axial skeleton and turns into a different shape. So the primer can change into different things to perform different jobs. Really cool development, and it's not a finalized machine just yet, but it's still a really impressive technology, and I think it's a sign of things to come. At number one, room bots. We're probably looking at one of the best robots when it comes to application diversity, and they're pretty much a limitless swarm which can do anything. So each module has connector plates and motors, allowing it to rotate and form chains with other modules. And so far they have moved furniture and assembled into larger robots. Let's just hope that conscious AI never emerges from these things. Regardless, I think this is where the future is with advanced robotics. Imagine a robot on the nano or even micro scale which can transform into different things. They would have unlimited potential, and they can form larger things such as humanoid robots. Now that might seem a little bit far-fetched for now, but keep in mind that breakthroughs in 3D printing could make this technology a reality. So yeah, the future is kind of scary. So once again, thanks for watching, please like the video if you enjoyed it, and make sure to subscribe to my channel.